If you guys are looking to buy the best game supplies and accessories, then you definitely need to check out www.fakeygrip.com. They are on a huge sale at the moment, actually selling the best PS4 controller cases for only up to £5. They're also selling the best Xbox One controller cases for up to £5 at the same price as the PS4 ones. And best of all, controller grips for PS4 and Xbox One for only £2.45. They are very nice. You can get any of these ones for only £2.45. If you want to buy these and you're interested in any of them, make sure to buy them. Add them to your cart, like so. And then you need to go to your cart, where your items actually are that you want to buy. And then you need to go to the checkout, but make sure to actually use this code, as I'm going to show you here. Make sure to use the code BILLPLAYS to get your yourself 10% off for your purchase. As you can see here, Bill plays. Bang, we're getting ourselves the 10% off here. Yeah, but that's all you need to do. Make sure to go check them out. They're the best company here, and you can get these very cheap. Yo guys, Bill plays Dash RL here, and today I'm going to be showing you 10 of my favourite heatwave colour combinations. So I'm going to be showing you for one for every colour in Rocket League. I think I missed out Lime. If I missed any others out, uh, comment down below. But if you guys have heatwave and you need some colour combinations for your car, then make sure to use these because they're looking pretty fresh. If you do enjoy this video, make sure to like it, subscribe. We are going to be doing the Toon Giveaway at 100 subs. Um, I will make a video on that. Also turn on notifications so you never miss a video. My next upload is going to be the first part of my Nothing to Storm Watch, and I will be doing a five players choice crate, crate wars. I know we literally did a crate wars, not a crate wars, a crate opening like literally a couple of days ago, but I'm going to be doing another one because you know it's only five crates, and someone wanted to do a crate wars with me. There's going to be like no rewards or like nothing, the winner's not going to get anything, but it will just be like a nice chill crate wars. But let's get into the first one. As you can see, I did change my new car. Here I actually got Forest Green Dracos, Forest Green Halo, and I also got Saffron Halo. And I also got some boosts because I thought I don't have a boost, so I'll get one. So I got this Saffron Magic Missile, which is pretty nice. And this uh, Forest Green Magic Missile, which is pretty nice. But let's get into the first colour combination. So the first one is um, Forest Green here. This is the one that I use for my main car, for my Forest Green car, which is pretty nice. If you do like that and you have a Forest Green car, make sure to get it. If you have Forest Green Dracos, it looks very nice like that with that, as you can see on my main car. The next one is Crimson. Now, Crimson Dracos, again, all Dracos look good with these colour combinations, but Crimson, the Crimson one is very nice. I might be getting myself some Crimson Dracos. If you want me to do a nothing to Crimson Dracos, comment that down below. So I wouldn't mind doing that, and I need some Crimson Drake because it look pretty nice on my Crimson car. Now the next one is Titanium White. Uh, again, Titanium White Zombos, Titanium White Apex Dracos. You probably don't have Apex, but you know. Um, Dracos, Titanium White Zombos look pretty nice with this car. I don't have any Titanium White wheels, so I can't show you. The next one is Purple. Now Purple looks very nice. I was thinking of getting this. Um, so I will be going back after I've shown you all of these and showing you the colours, like the primary and the accent colours, so you can actually use these for yourself. The next one is going to be the saffron, which I use in my main car. Looks very nice if you have some nice saffron wheels. If you have sa uh, saffron zombies, make sure to change one of your colours to sky blue, or just change one of them to blue and one of them to yellow, because sky blue zombies are yellow and blue. Now the next one is going to be the sky blue car. Now the sky blue car is just pretty nice. I mean sky blue Dracos, I haven't actually tried any sky blue wheels in this, so that's, yeah. Then we've got the orange one. Now the orange and burnt sienna do look quite similar, but the orange one is here. It's got like the fiery orange as the main colour, and then the back, like the accent colour is pretty decent. It's just like a, an orangey yellow. So like I said, they're basically the same if we look here. This one's just brown instead of like a fiery red. The next one is going to be pink. Now the pink one is quite hard to do because I think the primary colours for pink are a bit dark. 
um, but I was able to get one here. And then we've got the cobalt one, which is right there. That's very nice. I do like this cobalt one, but I don't know any good cobalt wheels to get with it. It looks very nice. Though. I actually really like the cobalt one. Cobalt one might be like my second favourite or my favourite. But that is all of the colours. Let's show you the colours now. So going into forest green, if we go to our colours, so the primary is going to be the first column on the second row for primary, and the accent is going to be the, the seventh column, and the fourth row, you can have the one next to that, but I just prefer this one, it looks more green instead of like lime, um, so that's that, and then you've got the crimson one, now the crimson colours, you're going to want to go to the third from the right, the, the third column from the right, all the way at the bottom, as you climb, it's basically the darkest red. Then you're going to want to go with the lightest red, which will be the second column and fourth colour down. Sounds pretty nice. And then you've got the titanium white, which is you want the lightest blue, so that's the fourth column, fourth down, and the top left, which is the white for your accent colour. Now the purple, again, like the crimson, you want the darkest purple colour which is the top right for the primary and then you're going to want to go the third column from the right and the third one down you want like the lightest purple again the darkest primary the lightest purple the lightest accent saffron this is on my main car you could go the lightest and the darkest but i just go the first column and the second one down so the second one down from the first column and then the brightest yellow most of these are following the same pattern with the brightest colour for each colour with the darkest colour. It looks pretty nice, especially with any Draco wheel that is the paint colour of your car. So this one's going to be the fifth column, fourth one down. Then the next one is going to be the sky blue. You don't want to use the darkest blue here because it doesn't look as right. You can if you want, but this one it just doesn't look very nice. So you want to use the fifth column, third one down. You don't have to use these colours, this is what I use. And then you just want to go to this one. I can't even just count it. You know, um, it is the, five, six, the seventh column from the right, third one down. Sorry about that one. The orange one, this was quite hard because you can't really, there's not really an orange colour for the primary, but for the primary, you're going to use the fourth column, third one down, and the fourth column, the fourth one down. So I've just gone with the orange for the primary, which looks pretty nice. You can go one more down just to make another like fiery orange like I have just done there and then change this one to orange if you want but I've just gone with this one now we've got the burnt sienna but the burnt sienna doesn't look as good since there is no like brown like or you could do this but that just looks like a brown burnt sienna is not really a, I, I don't know it depends what you think looks good these are my top 10 uh, heatwave colour combinations for every colour so say if you have a purple colour you can just use the purple one that I'm showing here just make sure to use it though if you want only but it does look very nice um, make sure to also get some boosts if you want me to make a other videos um, then I can just comment down below but with the burnt sienna we've gone with the third column all the way at the bottom so that one gives you a nice brown colour for your primary and accent is sort of the same colour for the orange accent it's just the fourth column third from the bottom and now we've got the pink one like I said, the pink was quite hard to do because no, the, 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 there's like, you could use this as a light pink, but I just don't think it looks right. But then we've got the, um, we've got this one, which is the last column on the right, second one down, and we've got the second from the right, second one down, for the pink, and then the last but not least we have the cobalt, which is probably my favourite, I just don't know any cobalt wheel to go with it. Third column from the right, one at the top. And this one is going to be the fifth column from the right, fourth one down. So guys, that is all for my top 10 heatwave colour combinations. If you did enjoy this video, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe, turn on notifications so you never miss a video. My next video is going to be tomorrow, we're trying to daily upload. It's going to be the first part of our Nothing to Storm Watch. I'm not going to be uploading Monday to Friday, because I won't be at my house. Um, uh, ha -ha. Yeah. I don't know, um, I'm not going to be here, so I won't be able to upload, so sorry about that, I'm not going to be able to upload uh, for this week, so that's sort of a rip in the chat, but you know, we're going to be carrying on with the daily uploads after that, uh, with the second part of Nothing Storm Watch and the third, and then carrying on from that, uh, but if you do want to see a top 10 
uh, colour combinations with the Intrudian Mystery Decal. Comment down below because I do have the uh, Intrudian Mystery Decal. Uh, also, I do have the the where is it? The Stormwatch. Now this is a little spoiler, but I did finish the Nothing to Stormwatch. You will be seeing that in the next few videos. If you want me to do an, a, like a top ten colour combinations with Stormwatch, then I can do that. Any other mysteries that I get, I will be be actually doing nothing. No, why don't um, I will be doing colour combinations with them. Um, but yeah, that is all for today's video. Again, like, subscribe, comment down below any of your video ideas, turn on notifications. Um, but yeah, that is all for today. I will check you in the next video. But yeah, see you in the next video.